Long before legendary UCLA basketball coach John Wooden became known as the Wizard of Westwood, he was the Wizard of the Wabash Valley. Coach Wooden died Friday at the age of 99. His first college coaching job was at Indiana State University from 1946 to 1948. Houston's Dan Klein sat down with a standout player who remembers his coach and friend. Dear Dwayne, I just heard about your surgery. Dwayne Clee treasures a letter coach John Wooden wrote to him after Wooden won his seventh consecutive championship at UCLA. But despite the accomplishment, the legend's words show the strain. This was a very trying year for me, Dwayne, primarily because of my own physical problems, the consecutive winning streak pressure, but the end result was very gratifying. Wooden coached Clee for two seasons at Indiana State University. Klee's the second player on the left in this picture. Back then, Klee would have never guessed he would be playing for a legend. He had a special aura about him, and uh, uh, he was going to be successful wherever he went and whatever he did. Klee is an All-American in his own right. But Coach Wooden, even in his mid-30s, wasn't afraid to play against his players in scrimmage. He could outdo us all, even at that age fine player. But Wooden was an even better coach. Klee coached the oh, ISU dear, basketball team for 12 years. Um, In 1964, he went head-to-head -head against the Wizard, who brought his defending champions to Terre Haute. He said, I'd just like to come back and uh, play your team. And uh, uh, so he did and uh, gave us a good whooping, too. Klee still has letters that Wooden wrote to him and his family. Tears come to his eyes as he describes the man. The greatest coach in the history of the game and a national treasure. A national treasure that got his start in the Wabash Valley. Reporting in Terre Haute, Dan Klein, News 10. For the full interview with Dwayne Klee, check out our website at WTHITV.com. Klee talks about more about what he learned from Coach Wooden and also retells the story when Wooden nearly got into a fight with another team. Oh, well, storms may